Hey, this is Jeff with Noah's RV. This is gonna give you a quick look at the different type of units we rent, help you decide which one is gonna be the best unit for your needs. Before we begin, do me a favor, subscribe, click the notifications bell so you'll know when we get new content out. And if you can, comment and like this video. We really appreciate it, it really helps us a lot. If you have any questions you want answered, list it down below and we'll get those answered for you as well. So, the question we have a lot of times is, what units do you rent? Well, in Miller's RV, we rent a Class B, multiple Class Cs, and a Class A motorhome. And they each have different features that might work better for your needs. So what we're gonna do today is look at each of those different type of units, the ones we rent, and see which one best fits your needs, so you can know which unit to rent. Hey, we're inside our 31-foot bunkhouse Mini Winnie Class C motorhome. So again, Class C, Ford front end, very easy drivable, very comfortable uh, dash AC up front, generator, roof air, microwave, awning, all of the features you're going to have on all of our rentals. This particular one, one of the benefits is it is a bunkhouse slide out unit. So there's a full wall slide on the driver's side, there's a rear queen bed, there's two bunk beds, there's a couch and dinette that both make beds, and an overhead sleeping area above the driving cab. So you could sleep up to 10 people in this unit if a couple of them are smaller kids. Uh, whatever number you have though, if this is a unit that a lot of the people with a larger group want to take. Some people though, I know for me, if I'm going to take go camping with just my wife and I, we still want the rear queen bedroom and a couch dinette. So it can work for you as a couple as well. So whether you have a lot of people who want to go with you, or you just want the space with, an, with a separate bedroom and a separate living area, this could work great for you. Also, the 31 foot bunkhouse has an outside TV. So if you're tailgating or if you like to sit outside and watch a movie at night or watch the games during the day, that's a great thing as well. So it'll have that on all of our Bunkhouse Mini Winnies. This might be the right rental for you. Okay, we're inside our 31 foot Winnebago Outlook. This unit is again a Class C motorhome, so it has a small driving cab up front, uh, overhead bunk as well. So very easy to drive, very easy to, to travel around with. It is 31 feet long, so it is a long unit as well, not a bunkhouse. So this has a rear queen bed has a couch and dinette that both make beds and an overhead bed. So queen bed, kind of a double bed, and then uh, maybe a three quarter bed, not quite a double, and a twin bed roughly. So could sleep up to eight people if a couple of them are small kids, but all in all, they're really gonna be more for the, uh, probably five or six people more than, than eight. Um, lots of living area in this, there's a really big counter. The bedroom actually has a little more privacy and a little bigger than what you have in the Mini Winnie because you have some space on it. Um, nice size shower and bathroom as well. So if this might be the coach that fits for you, also the outside, the awning on this is huge. So if you wanna have a lot of tailgating area outside or a big area for the awning space, this awning is bigger than any other unit we rent, that might work for you as well. So again, 31 Outlook, this might be the rental just for you. So I'm in our 24 Outlook. This is the smallest of the Class C's we rent. Again, small driving front area with an overhead cab. So it is a Class C motorhome and it's the shortest length, 24 feet. Now this unit does not have a couch. So it has a dinette only and there's no, no slide out in the front living area. So it's a little tight in the front living area, but it is a much smaller unit. The other Class C's are all 31 feet. So this one's easier to get around in tight spaces and some people just wanna have a smaller driving experience. Now it does still have a full queen bed in the rear of the unit. While the Mini Winnie and the Outlook 31 foot, both the beds are usable when your slides are in. This bed in the back, when the slide is in, you can't sleep in it when you're going down the road because it's not, the bed, the slide goes out and the bed folds over. So smaller length, if this is what you want, We'll still sleep five or six people, depending whether you have kids or not for the, the dinette that makes a bed. Uh, and again, a smaller experience, but you still get refrigerator, awning, microwave, water heater, all of the other features on there, but in a 24 foot package. So this might be the right rental for you. Okay, so I'm in our Class A Winnebago Vista. This is the only Class A we rent. It is a 31 foot bunkhouse floor plan. So it's actually the same floor plan as our 31 foot Class C Mini Winnie, but it is a little bit larger. So the couch area and the dinette area are a little bit bigger. Uh, the storage outside is a lot bigger. And the overhead bunk on this, instead of being a fixed bunk in a Class C, it comes down electrically when you park, and it's actually a little smaller than the Class C. So like the Mini Winnie, this can sleep up to 10 people. That would be the right 10 people. You have to have a couple small kids, but there's a rear queen bed. There's two bunk beds will both sleep adults. There's an overhead bed above the driving area, which is a double. Could sleep two adults, it's a little tight. And then there's a couch and a dinette. The couch is a little bit shorter. The dinette 
is a little narrow. Both those are roughly around twin bed size. So that's your sleeping arrangements. Now your class A, because it's a class A, it sits up higher. Your driving area sits up higher. So some people do feel a little more um, comfortable in a class C because it feels like a regular van where this you're sitting higher and a little wider out than you are in a regular car. But the benefit of that is you do get a lot more storage underneath because there's a big basement storage area. Like our Class C Mini Winnie, this also does have an outside entertainment center, so there's an outside TV. And of course, like all of our units, generator, air conditioner, microwaves, awning, all of the fun features like that. So if you're looking for a family, it, this is great for a couple, it's great for people traveling if you want to do it, it's great for a large party. Um, a really fun, easy unit to drive as well. Uh, I find perfectly the Class A's. I like them because there's a big view out the front window. Some people like that better too. So this might be the right rental for you. Okay, so now I'm in our one Class B rental, a Winnebago Solus. This is a 59X and the Solus is a great little unit uh, if you want to take something very, very small. So a B literally is built inside of a van body. This is only 21 feet long, which is just a little bit longer, a couple feet, than a Suburban. So very, very easy to drive. You can park it in regular parking places. You cannot drive through a drive through Do not do that. It is too tall. Uh, it does have a generator, which is the new Onan 2.8 Ultra Quiet Generator. So it's quiet enough to even operate in National Forest. And it does have a roof air conditioner. So it does have that. The back area of this, uh, the front area of it has two driver and passenger seat, a nice little dinette area, which uh, two chairs so you can ride four people. And then the driver's seat and the passenger seat will turn around to give you a little dinette sitting area. And then the rear, there is a great storage area behind me you can see. And you can use that for bicycles or anything like that. And then there's a bed that will fold down across and you sleep across the vehicle to give you your uh, double-sized bed here. There's also privacy screens that Velcro in on all the windows. They can zip open for uh, air to come through, but they also can block out the light. So really nice privacy screens. And they're screened in entrances, both on the, the sliding door and the rear doors. So if you are do go to a cooler area, you can leave the screens down and keep the bugs out. There's even a magnet so you can walk in and out of the side door and the magnet will close back and close it back off. So great little unit. This might be perfect for you. This is normally a couple. It can travel for people, can only sleep two. So normally a couple that wants to travel, a lot of times people want to uh, check out a B van, see what it's like before they consider buying one. This is a great way to do that. So again, this is the Winnebago Solus and this might be the right RV for you. So hopefully this video has helped you decide which unit is right for your rental vacation. If you want more information as to what makes an A and A, a B and B, a C, and what the heck is a B plus, please check out this video here. It'll give you more information about what that is. Also, there's links to videos of all the units that are more in depth if you want to take a look at what they are. This is just a run through to give you the differences between them. So whatever it is, give us a call if you have questions. We'll be glad to answer them. You can post below. We always comment back. If there's anything else you want to see in a video, let us know. We'll be glad to do it. Again, this is Jeff at Miller's RV, and we want you to, in this case, enjoy the rental journey. Hey, thank you so much for watching this video. We hope it was both informative and entertaining. Please subscribe, click the link, notification button, comment below, click one of these other links and watch one of the other videos. We appreciate you. Enjoy the journey.